think I was probably always interested in music. I mean, I've been told, I've got no memory of this, but I've been told that when I was little, I used to uh, dance around to shout Tears for Fears. That was my favourite song at the time. Um, so it's been a lifelong thing, really. would have been around about my 11th birthday. Uh, I just got to secondary school and uh, they sort of had the option then to start learning a musical instrument. So they uh, gave me a long list of instruments, everything from the French horn and tuba through to the piccolo. But uh, I chose guitar. And uh, so my mum uh, had a friend at that time who was a Cub Scout leader and she had an acoustic guitar. So my mum borrowed that guitar off, me, uh, off a friend and uh, that got me started. Uh, first band that I joined, it was actually in late 2009. Um, a group of friends, like-minded friends that I worked with at the time, uh, we decided to get together and, and start a band. Um, we called it Black Rock Temple. And uh, after about a year of hard rehearsal, we finally got through to play our first gig. Um, and we booked out the Cavern, which is underneath the Crown, it's the next market in Bristol. Um, we absolutely packed the place out, played two sets, each set more than an hour, um, and just, yeah, the other crowd would have been to just keep going all night, I think. It's uh, really good. But no, on the whole, I think uh, I really enjoyed it. It was very sociable, um, and we played well together. It was a, it was a good band. I've been through quite a lot of phases, I think, I guess uh, every musician probably does. When I was first getting started out, it was uh, I think Eric Clapton and Mark Knopfler were probably my, uh, my two big guitar icons. Um, and a few years later, I discovered Slash and became a devoted follower. Um, and then from there, I started discovering more sort of heavy metal, uh, bands like Iron Maiden, Judas Priest. Um, but then more recently, I found myself going back to that sort of classic 60s British blues, um, artists like Eric Clapton, uh, Robin Trower, uh, Rory Gallagher, and finding the things they were doing then with their, uh, with the effects and the sound and the tone, and, uh, and just taking that classic blues feel imported from America but giving it a British twist. What I'm doing at the moment is uh, not a lot really. I mean, I'm part of a three-piece acoustic. Uh, band with just a couple of friends um, and we just get together when we can and play but uh, unfortunately everyone's pretty busy with real life so we don't get together that much now and uh, and I guess really what I'd like to do is get back into a rock band. <laughs> difficult these days to uh, to actually make a career out of, uh, out of music out of being in a band that the only realistic aim you can have is to have fun um, and to, to make good music 